Greetings. I am Nikki. This is Midlife Adulting. Welcome or welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I am so glad to see you. And if you are returning, I appreciate you coming back so very much. So today's video is something I, I, I don't know. Maybe I've tried this before. I don't know. Basically, uh, some of you may know that my dad passed away late January and I'm dealing with it okay but one thing I've noticed since then is leading up from the moment I found out he was entering hospice until the day he passed I was I was consistently doing a practice in my life that I feel does me good and that was writing every day three things I'm grateful for and 25 affirmations I haven't done that since he passed and I think I'm kind of resentful about my dad not being here anymore and that's why I'm not doing it but I think I need to get back into the practice and so I thought well if I force myself to on camera then that will help get me going so I have brought out my Dollar Tree self-care kit, emergency self-care kit. Um, it feels like this is a good time for such a thing. And so I thought I would pop it open and let's see what it is. I gave myself two cards. I don't know which one I need. I'm going to pick the pink one because I like pink. I'm going to see what card I left myself. Be bold, be bright, be you. No one can do it better. And don't you forget it. You are the best you that could ever exist. Don't let yourself think otherwise. Love, Nikki. Yeah. Yeah. Well, I'm going to put this back in because I have a feeling I might need that message again someday. Here. It back in so it's not sealed and it doesn't get ruined. I'm gonna go ahead and set the other card aside and I will put it back in um, in the future. What did I put in here? Fresh Cherry Carmex Daily Kale. Well, I have been biting my lips like crazy, so yeah. Oh, it feels nice. Okay. I like that. I have stickers. They're not all as cute as the front page though. There are lots of hearts. I have a puzzle in here. What I really need, I do not need a sleep mask. I don't really need the stickers. I don't need the manicure kit. I did bring myself a notepad. Maybe this is what I'll use, but let's see what else I have in here. Envelopes for leaving myself notes, letters. For your mind, I need a journal. All right, we're gonna use this. Not using the notepad. Putting the chapstick back in. I got a bunch of different pens. Click, clip, click. All right, these are ball points, so I'm gonna use pink and teal. That just feels right. What else do I have here? I have a book of Sudoku. I have a word search book. I might do one of these just as sort of some self-care to kind of wind myself down because I had a lot of caffeine today, but also I am clearly not processing my dad's death. And maybe that means that I've processed it up to and I'm fine, but I kind of feel like maybe I'm not. So we're just gonna use that. What else do I have in here? Candy, rocks, washcloth, 
It's a variety of other pens that I might need. I do have some cute note cards. I might, I might use those too. All right. For right now, let's pack this stuff back up as best I can. Actually, oh, I'm picking a sticker. I think I'm going to flip the camera down so that you can follow along with me. Um, you can do this yourself, maybe start it as a practice, or maybe just, you know, skip ahead. I'll try to put chapters in this video for you. Okay. Okay. Here we go. Free your mind. I need a unicorn for this. Oh, this is going to be hard to get out. Oh my goodness. That was a much All right. Stickers. Now. Today is the 6th. It is a Tuesday, but this is going up on Wednesday. I thought maybe I'd call this Wellness Wednesday. We'll see. Three things I am grateful for. And see, this has been hard. I have the opportunity to list gratitudes every single day since dad passed and it's not that I can't bring myself to do it. I just haven't. So I need something easy. Okay, I am grateful. To have gotten through half of the Half's form tonight with help. Okay, I don't love this pink. This pink looks so much better than the ink does, but that's okay. I am grateful. What else am I grateful for? I am grateful. Okay, third thing I am grateful for, I am grateful for, <laughs> I am grateful, mom doesn't like dad's beef jerky. There we go. Okay, those are gratitudes. The thing I'm really avoiding, maybe I'll just do it here on the back, is the affirmations. This is gonna be hard because the affirmation I was using when my dad was sick was, I am very grateful for the strength to get through this. I am so very grateful for the strength to get through this. And 
that doesn't fit anymore. I mean, it's not like I'm through it, but... And it, I want it to be something that I'm writing in present tense as if it already exists. So a little bit of manifestation. The one I usually choose is I am grateful for the $2,000 I'll earn this year from YouTube. I, I have earned this year from YouTube. I don't know if I like that one. I'm starting with the blue, or is it the pink stern? It is the pink stern. You know, I'm starting it here. to be specific so I can't be like achieve everything on my vision board <sighs> there we go and because I usually just do separate lines, I'm just gonna go ahead and squish this together. Since I'm swapping colors. I need another sticker. <sighs> All right. That felt pretty good. a different pen. I can't stand those pens. <laughs> Okay. Okay. I thought maybe I would do a puzzle. I might do this off camera. I don't think I want to do it tonight. So if you haven't ever done what I just did, writing down 25 affirmations, and they can be, um, they can be affirmations like, um, I am so grateful for the $2,000 I earned from YouTube this year. 
I am so grateful for the strength to get through this trying time like I just used. Um, I am I am so and I am so grateful to earn a hundred thousand dollars this year at my job. I am so grateful for the opportunities that I am going to encounter this year. I am so very I am so very grateful for the money that will come my way this year. That it is coming my way this year. Because you want to make sure it's present tense and everything. And as if it's already happened. Um oh, I need to get this back in here too. I do it because it works and I even occasionally turn my gratitudes into things that I'm grateful for this thing that has happened that hasn't happened yet. I did that more than once uh, with hospice. I'm so grateful the hospice aid is coming after this meeting that my dad has planned. I am so very grateful for um, things along that line. Um, it's silly, but I am so very grateful for the rain waiting to fall until I get home. Works for me almost every time. And the times that it doesn't like work, it's not raining as hard as it was or it's sprinkling. Or I have time to wait in the car and I pick the right moment to get out and make a dash for it. I am so very grateful to get out into traffic easily. Those things work for me. They work and it's little small things that don't at first seem like they add up to much and yet it changes my life. And in little ways I want to work these into my routine every single day so that I am at the very least manifesting small helpful things for myself. So this was good. I feel better about going back to my planner for tomorrow. I didn't use that planner because there's things in there that I need to keep private, but I I'm glad I had this, I, I made this opportunity for myself to get back into the swing of things because I was really avoiding it. I was really avoiding it. I was really avoiding it. Well, at any rate, I hope um, you've enjoyed this video. If you have, I, I would love it if you could click the like button. If you've really, really liked it and you want to see more content like this, hit the subscribe button and that will let me know what folks are interested in seeing. And that is all I have for today. I hope you're having a fantastic day. If you're not having a fantastic day, I hope you're having a good day. If you're not having a good day, I hope tomorrow is better. I will see you all later. Bye, love you, bye.